Hi, namaste, namaste. Hmm. I see namaste means I see the goddess uh, that you are. I see your true nature. And uh, I, I bow, I love it. I love your true nature. <laughs> that's, that's what namaste means. Um, <clears throat> so, we... We women have a, we have a a, a yoni sadhana coming up, a yoni love sadhana. It's coming upon us soon, <laughs> and in this sadhana, in this in this uh, love love yoni sadhana. What it is in in this in this calling, it's a pilgrimage. So, mm, long time ago now, a long time ago now, women would walk across the desert, guided by the moonlight, and find their way, feel their way, to the sacred yoni, in the center of the desert. <laughs> like the center of a lotus flower. And they'd walk together, and sometimes at night you might feel quite alone and wonder where your sisters are and feel lost. And then the next night you'd suddenly be upon them again. So sometimes you are alone, and sometimes you are together in this pilgrimage, this love walk into your yoni. Love walk. You're going to take a love walk into your yoni. Because only when we truly know how to love walk, love journey into the center of our yoni, um, could we possibly teach another how to do that or invite another to do that perhaps is a better expression. So we're doing a very feminine journey actually into the yoni, but it doesn't, well it embraces also the masculine. So we have some structures, you know, we as we're going into the sadhana, it's it's like we're entering a temple that is made from like your being. It, the temple comes from your energy. It's not made in form. We can't make it out of bricks or mud or even trees. This temple is made from your very being and what you bring and what you feel and where you go. You make the temple. And the four pillars of our temple, the first one, which I've told you about, is the pilgrimage, walking across the desert by the moonlight to the center of your yoni. It's the pilgrimage, together and alone. And the second pillar is the moonlight, the light of la luna. It's the, you know, and sometimes she's so dark, and other times she's full, full, full moon. And she really intensifies the way when it's full moon. So the light of the yoni is going to show us different aspects of our womb. But sometimes you'd be surprised. You can only see something when there's a little bit of light. <laughs> um, so that's our second pillar. Then our third pillar is the medicine that we will be drinking along the way. Of a very beautiful flower and uh, it could be easy for you it won't you won't struggle to find this flower and uh, this flower is going to help to open our heart and as the heart opens then we can truly enter deeper into the love the love sadhana and the fourth pillar is the love sadhana you know it is the the sacred intimate, intimate, intricate practices we do, breathing in prana and feeding that to our womb, and very intimate, very intimate and very love practices we'll have with our yonis to help her to uh, sing her song again. So those are the four pillars and the central a theme I weave through the pilgrimage 
is the theme of silence and the song, where you start to discover how the song is arising out of this deep, dark, yin well of silence. That's where the song is coming from. From that dark silence rises the song. So that's a really deep theme that's going to be woven into this pilgrimage, into the sadhana. And as part of that, you are going to be invited to look into the dark, to see in the dark, as Dr. Estes might say. I'm going to see in the dark. And when you look into the dark, you're looking for the things perhaps you don't want to feel or are afraid of feeling, you know, your regret, your broken, broken heart, <laughs> and feelings of doubt, which becomes guilt. You really doubt yourself. You feel that what you're doing is wrong, and that becomes guilt. So doubt leads to guilt. Which is a very oh, sure, it's an intense one to to carry and to feel and everything, you know. But we're going to look at those, and I can feel already they're going to be tough, you know. Maybe stuff you really don't want to feel. So, my invitation for this pilgrimage, because we're going to look into some dark dark places sometimes, <laughs> is to invite women to come along who can walk by themselves. We're walking together sometimes, but we're not carrying each other. The energies will carry us, but we still have to walk ourselves across that desert. So come prepared to walk yourself across a desert of your soul. <laughs> well, I'm there, Shima, I'm there. <laughs> it's going to be fun, all right? We're going to have fun. It's going to be fun. It's going to be amazing. Walking, you know, it sounds like hard work, but walking at night across a desert with a group of phenomenally, beautifully awake, bubbling oh, women. Well, that's, that's worth doing. So, and as we start to clear that, or feel, feel the feelings we haven't wanted to feel, feel the aspects of self we haven't wanted to feel, like doubt. We start to feel them, um, that... That, that becomes our song. That's the song. And it changes into the song and into the dancing. The, the dancing song of your very nature. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so that's something of our pilgrimage, our Yoni love sadhana that we are beginning on the 18th of September. And... I invite you to join by the Tuesday, uh, which I see, the 15th of September, so that you know you're going and you can prepare for this very strong energy journey that's coming to us. Nice not to get too last minute in your decision making, you know, like, get on it, trust yourself, join, talk to friends, family if you need to raise money. You know, use the power, invite the power of the yoni to call in the sacrifice that wants to be made. Um, I've discounted the rate down to $210 and 2,230 rand. That's for anyone joining. I don't feel like putting a time limit that like you have to join on Monday or something like that. So no, it's just like that. Though, if you want to join on Monday, this Monday now, which is the 7th of September, which is a beautiful day to join because it's moon day. It's the day of the moon, the day of the goddess La Luna. And that's uh, one of our patrons on this pilgrimage. So if you join on Monday, this Monday now, I feel it would be a great honor to the moon in this pilgrimage. And I want to also say, if you were invited to come to this, um, this gathering, someone shared it, shared the conversation with you, you know, shared a, a link, let's call it, or something. If someone did that, please tell me who it is, because then I want to give them another discount, another 5% off what they're going to pay. I want to say thank you for doing that, and it's like you saying thank you as well. So if you shared with me, I'll say, oh, you know, um, Chloe has said that um, 
our dear friend uh, Juliette has invited her and then I'll go hey Juliette Chloe invited you you know and I'd like to just offer you a gift to say thank you you know I, uh, Chloe has said Juliette you have been in I've been invited by Juliette I want to give Juliette a gift so please let me know if there's any woman that invited you because then I could give them that gift as well for their their sadhana That'd be wonderful, and I, I just feel it. In, it immediately invites some friendliness and sweetness between the sisters. That we've been generous with each other and acknowledging who, who invited you, and that I can acknowledge them, and we're just sharing a bit of that sweet, sweet love of of what it is to walk as women together across the desert. It takes something to do that. Um, yeah, and then in in a in a. A written form, I shall send you a the dates of our meetings, which will be two Fridays and two Saturdays, and then there'll be a, a group, a, a small group meeting in between where you can choose dates. I'll send those dates later, uh, which you can choose your time and date to join. There'll be specific ones because you'll still be in a small group, but I'll give you a few choices, <laughs> and then we get to really hear from you and what's what's going down for you in your pilgrimage and I, I look forward to hearing that I'll be in each of the groups so and I'll also be responding to the shadows that are appearing in you directly in that group and all those groups will be shared with everyone so you can all learn from one another as well and what's going on so we can like hear everybody's conversation which is quite nice you know to hear everyone's conversation if you want to of course that's not um, you don't have to listen to everyone's but it's there for you if you like so you can see what everyone is learning along the way yeah yeah so I hope you make up your mind soon and I shall send you um, a payment link the EFT in, for South African people, for the people who live in South Africa, there'll be a direct bank you can uh, join. And for other people, I will send um, a, a payment link such as PayPal. I haven't made my, I might be PayPal and it might be uh, uh, another system, uh, what's it called, TransferWise. Because I'm trying to find a system that charges the least in fees. Because in my heart, I don't feel the bank institutions should have such high fees because that goes back to us having to pay those fees. So I'd like to, to be a fair fee. So I'm just trying to choose the best place that offers the fairest fee um, on the transferring money from overseas that normally has a fee. So I'm trying to find a fair rate. And I'll send you that link as well. All right. Ah, so thank you. Oh, it's all very beautiful and exciting. I can't wait to walk with you across the desert. Share that journey with you. I've walked it myself, by myself, with no sisters with me. It's extraordinary. Namaste.